This edition of the Ridley Report is brought to you by LRN.FM. Feds don't want you to hear them. How are you? Good, how are you doing? I understand that there are special treatments being given to bureaucrats here, that they don't have to go through the metal detector, but average people do. Is that true? No. So bureaucrats have to go through the metal detector too to get to the upper part of, of City Hall? No one's getting allowed through without having to go through the metal detector. Is that nope. true? Now, when the mayor comes through, does he have to get checked too, or does he just go up to his office? No, he's a city employee. Okay, so as city employees are not, no one is, no one is required to. I do appreciate that you're talking to me as opposed to just threatening to arrest well, me. I'm about to stop talking to you unless you turn that thing off. No, that's not going to happen. Well, then I'm not going to talk to you. And I'm going to keep right. asking questions to someone who's not answering them. When an employee of the city manager's office goes upstairs, do they get special treatment? They don't have to go through the metal detector? So this, I'm going to take that as a affirmative, a yes, since you just said city employees, employees don't have to go through. You just said bureaucrats get the same treatment, but now you're saying that city employees don't have to go through the metal detector, but other people do. <laughs> well, okay, it beats a taser. I'll take, I'll take the silence over the taser any day. But is that appropriate for you to be giving bureaucrats special treatment? In a, is something that's supposed to be the court system, it's supposed to be for everybody. Have you ever been involved in making someone turn the camera off on the second floor where there's censorship enacted? Well, if you haven't, then I appreciate that, and I hope you never do that. When is this facility going to move? I understand that you're, again, maybe moving to Jaffrey or something like that? I think there's something in the newspaper about that. Oh, I can find that. I can Google that. It's no big deal. Uh, you know, I was kind of glad to hear you. You work for King PD, sir? No, sir, I do not. Uh, you work for the city? I work for the AOC. For the court? For the county, yes. I see. What is this about city employees not having to go through the metal detector, but average people have to go through the metal detector? Why the special treatment? It's not special treatment, it's the city employees, and they have an ID for them. It's because they've gone through some kind of process right. to get. I see, okay. Could I get an ID that lets me go through here without uh, having to? If you're a city employee. Well, do I have, so but there you go. There's a difference between city employees and average people in that case. And they're treated special. I rest my case. But I, again, I appreciate your demeanor and his too. I get a lot worse out here doing this. <laughs> well, you have a great day. Have okay. Great I beg your pardon? Enjoy it. Well, I have a few more questions to ask, but I don't think I have any more for you. I'll, we'll find out later if I think of any. LRN.FM, 24 hours of Liberty Radio every day. Now available on satellite, too, at sat.lrn.fm. <laughs>
That's what a satellite sounds like. Put it on your unlicensed station. Wear it in your hair. But above all, don't despair. The Liberty message is getting out. And right now, you're missing it. Or maybe you're not. But skip on over to LRN.FM. Feds don't want you to hear them.